Well, here's something you don't see every day. One clinic providing vaccines for people and pets. Washington State University students provided both today, all under one roof. In an effort to help people maintain their health, the university gave pet owners and their animals some free health care today. One university spokesperson says people come to the clinic to help their pets and get a COVID or flu shot for themselves. Eleni Dow gives us a look at the clinic in our vaccine information headquarters. The purpose of this vaccination clinic today is to get people vaccinated as well as help their pets like Domino here to get vaccinated and a checkup. We all have busy schedules. As a student, Alejandro Lopez is buried with school and work and taking care of his dog Domino. This clinic is a treat for the both of them. He got dewormed and then also we got a nice checkup and a lot of treats. <laughs> While WSU vet students gave Domino a checkup, Alejandro did too, even getting his flu shot. It would be a tough t time to schedule something like that for, for our schedules and I'm just so glad that this worked out for us. Alejandro and 55 other people got vaccinated and health checkups from the WSU nursing school and school of veterinary medicine. A lower turnout compared to the last four clinics. The university contributes that to the rain and pandemic. Hi, cute kitten. But it still helped people get what they need. Honestly, I think that a lot of times they're coming for their pets and we kind of crowd them into getting vaccines for themselves. Um, so we're kind of using the pets as bribery. <laughs> Free also helps as some people don't have the means to get health care. Lindy Hobbs says it's helpful for her being on disability. For her cat Piglet to finally get the shots he needed, it meant a lot. He's, he's my whole world, and I've felt really bad that I haven't been able to bring him in. And when I found out about this free clinic, I knew I could, I could come in and it would be extremely affordable. And I'm, I'm thrilled that they're, they're doing this, and the donations are incredible. Oh, look at how nice you are. The university hopes to have another clinic like this next year, wanting to help people like Alejandro or dogs like Domino. But it all depends on funding. In Spokane, Eleni Dow, 4 News Now.